What's up, everyone? It's your boy Two Phones for free, aka the GOAT for free. Um, this is a video about Android 11. Now, as you may know, I got the Pixel 3a XL, and I've been rocking the beta for, for all this time. I've been using the Android 11 beta all up until this past week, which we have gotten the official build of Android 11 on all the Pixels from Pixel 2 all the way up to the Pixel 4a, which is the latest budget Google phone. All right, so no further ado, I'm going to show you guys exactly that I'm on the official build. You go to the Android settings. You want to go to about phone and you want to find where it says Android 11 version. You want to tap on that and here we are. Android 11 security patch September the 5th, 2020. You want to tap on that and you get this little Easter egg thing. You can play with it a little bit, you know. You can do something with it. So, uh, and it shows that. This is how you know you're on the official Android 11 bill. So here we are. Right now, uh, my, my carriers I'm using is TextNow, Free Talk, and Text Nationwide. And I also got the Google Fi on deck with the dual SIM setup. Yes, sir. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, so that's what we're doing. Um, I, I'm just running some tests right now with the Talking Text Free plan on my Pixel. And it does work, ladies and gentlemen, for anyone um, they got family and friends that's looking to cut the bill, cut the phone bill. Uh, I'll leave a link in the description box. You can go to textnow.com. Or if they want to try Google Fi, googlefi.com. All right. So um, my favorite features, I'm going to tell you all this right now, man. The control center. The control. I got that. Shout out to PayPal and Cash App. Get your Cash App and your PayPal ready. That, yeah, you got that on deck. Um, you got your emergency on deck. You got your lockdown. And you got your power. Your power only pops up two options, the power off or the restart. Um, also, what I found out by using this TextNow service, I got my Google Home set up, right? And the controls, as you can see, these are all the lights. I can turn off all the lights right now without internet, without Wi-Fi on this TextNow plan. Watch this. We're going to do this. We're going to do this on this video right now. Everything just went dark, right? Look. Oh, I can't show it right now, okay? Everything just went dark, but watch this, though. Boom! Everything kept back on, man. That's what's up, man. Yeah, I like these control centers. It gives you very detailed things about your lights, percentages of the light bulbs, all that stuff. So I like that right now. Uh, we're going to go ahead and go down to the notifications, and we're going to talk about that, too. So right now, you're looking at the media center, all right? All right, so I was watching some ESPN. You know, I was watching some ESPN going on. I can pause that. I can swipe over. I can listen to some Juice World. You know, I can listen to some Juice World. And also, it's giving you phone speaker options, which is also cool. I don't know why they do that. Hold on. Maybe I did something wrong. Let me, uh, yeah, let me go up, down, and then hit the phone speaker. There we go. So now it's giving you option to use Bluetooth, wireless speaker whatever all right so you got that option in the media control center and what i still like about the pixels man is you can use your fingerprint to bring down a notification you ain't got to touch the screen you know what i'm saying with this pandemic you ain't got to touch the screen no more you know so uh <laughs> yeah man go and check out this uh android 11 man i, I guarantee man everybody should get a pixel get that everybody should get a pixel but anyways i also like the um suggestive apps at the bottom so Google is suggesting that I'm using these apps um, at a certain time. So I'm not really using the settings, but I was just showing that as, a, as an example. Um, yeah, I do do the talking text from text now, so that's, that's right. Um, I play around with the Android, Google Messages every now and then. Of course, I'm using YouTube, and of course, I'm using YouTube Music. You know what I'm saying? So um, is it smart? Not really, but it's, 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 it's decent. It's cool. All right, so um, another cool thing I like is when you scroll up, let's say I want to take a screenshot. All right, so here, we got a screenshot of Juice World. Boom, I want to take a screenshot. Here we go. We got share. Let's check out the share settings. Let's see what pops up. All right, so you got nearby. So since I don't have Wi-Fi, Internet, or whatever like that, I can um, share it with nearby devices. Not sure if it's going to work, but... Um, can't access nearby share to share with devices nearby turn on your Bluetooth location and Wi-Fi 
All right, so that's how you would have to share. Okay, um, also select. If you have to, you can select the text or whatever like that. So that's a cool feature going on with the screenshot error and, you know, all that when you go to your most recent applications. Um, let me see if I can do something a little bit better than that. All right, okay, let's go to this Boston joint. Okay, so let me put that up and let me see if I can select. All right, there we go. That's, that's better. It's highlighting all the different texts. And you can copy and paste all that stuff. So keep that in mind, man. I, I, I do like those new features going on with Android 11. Uh, also, custom custom styles and wallpapers. Um, and they finally stepped the game up in this era. Okay, so here we go. You go to styles. I, I got my two phones for free style one. If you want that, let me know. All right, because it's something different. Something different. So here we go. Custom styles. So you can customize the font. All right, you go to next. You can customize your icons. You can pick them any way. You can make them look like um, I don't know what what that is. That the old school. You know what I'm saying? We got the new school. Where actually they're kind of like Nexus. I don't know. I think it's more like Nexus right here. I think that's what I got. But yeah, that's some like Huawei stuff, iPhone stuff, whatever you want to call it like that. Then you go to next. You can change the colors. You know what I'm saying? Favorite color green. So that's why I got green on my accent. You know, then you go to next. And then you can change different color uh, icon packs. Now that's new. I have not seen that one before. That's new. I might actually have to try that one out. So yeah. Um, you got a couple of new icons. Icon shapes in here. So yeah, give it give it a try, man. Um, it's in when you hold down your home screen. It's in styles and wallpapers. And that's how you can change that. Now you want to go to home settings. I'm not sure if anything's new in here. Uh, at a glance, I think that's okay. So the suggestions, like I mentioned, you can actually turn that off. So if you do not like the suggestions, you can turn that off. Whoop de woo, whatever like that, um, stuff like that. So you can turn it off if you want to. It is showing you, it is describing basically the time of day you use any certain apps. Um, so yeah. Or you can block you can block apps for not being involved in that you know suggestions list. So yeah, give that a try, man. Um, yeah, those are my favorite um, you know uh, features in Android 11. Also, do not forget your know, there are bubbles when you get notifications. My notifications are turned off for the video because I'm gonna get tons of them even without Wi-Fi. I'm gonna get tons of them. All right, so. <laughs> um, yeah, so you got the bubble chat. Um, we can go into the settings real quick. Let me see. Um, see, it took it off the suggestions because I'm not using it right now. But um, you can go to the apps and then you can go through um, bubble suggestions or whatever like that. Let me see if it pops up. What apps will it pop up? Okay, so none of these pipe popping up with the. Well, let's just check out conversations. Okay, so, so these are my conversations with the bubbles and all that. So whenever they send me a message, a bubble pops up. But anybody that don't have Android 11 right now, I'm, I'm telling you this. Facebook Messenger and text now. Talking text and Facebook Messenger for Android, any Android device, has bubble chat already. And you can check out SMS apps like Post, Textra, uh, Yada, like I mentioned in some of my live streams. Those already have bubble chats. If you do not have Android 11, um, right away or your phone is not going to get updated to Android 11 and another way you can find out if your phone is going to get updated is you go to your settings this is my last thing you go to your settings you're going to your about me section no actually you're going to go to your system all right then you're going to go to advanced and then you're going to go to system update down here at the bottom if my camera focuses come on camera focus all right there we go and then you just hit the check for update. And then it's going to check for your update and then all that stuff like that. And then, hey, if your phone gets Android 11, it gets Android 11. But another way you find out is you go to the Android website or uh, you follow your, your OEM, like Samsung, LG, Motorola, whoever. And you just say, or you, you Google search what phones will get Android 11. Matter of fact, let's just do that. Let's just Google search. What phones will get Android 11? What phones will get Android 11? Let 
There it goes. It's searching. Okay, Google Assistant, you tweaking. Okay, there it go. See? It worked. <laughs> it was a little slow, but it worked. So it's right as of right now, it's showing the Xiaomi Mi 10, Mi 10 Pro, the Google Pixel 4a, Google Pixel 4, Google Pixel 3a, 3a XL, Pixel 3, 3XL, 2, 2XL. So as of right now, these are all the phones that can get Android 11 as of today. So if you got any of them phones, make sure you go check your uh, settings. And yeah, that's right, man. So here we go, man. Android 11 with the Pixel 3a XL. Um, those are my favorite features and functionalities. Um, if you got some that I did not mention that you like, please drop your comments and thoughts in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. It's your boy. Two phones for free.